since the beginning of my YouTube channel, I've promised that I've always complete my view followers, viewers, subscribers, wishes. And that's what I'm doing today. Many people see Arknights EN community, content creator community as bad, and probably because of one specific YouTuber with the name of Technase. Okay, so yeah. Today, I want to do something special, and that is expose this bad YouTuber of his bad claims, and they've said multiple times before there are bad claims. I expose him because he's not a pro, that he makes really bad videos, and we'll be talking about them more. Watch this video, because Technase over here is going to expose the YouTuber so-called Technase that does a lot of our nice content. Let's go. So yeah, um, I don't really care. I just saw that people, not saying videos are doing bad or anything like that, don't. I just know that I make a lot of bad claims. That's known. I know that personally. Uh, it's nothing new for me. Because I have made many worse claims before. Way worse claims before. Or wait, where is it? Let me find it. I don't know why I can find it, okay. Oh yeah, wait. I I already recorded this video. And uh, the audio was shit, so I thought... Let me just... Why not? Let me... Oh, uh, let me just re-record it. So it's gonna be better now. I'm gonna be hopping in and talking about all my videos, all my bad takes, how much my opinion has changed on them. But yeah, we're gonna be hopping in right now. If you enjoy this kind of content, like subscribe, but I doubt it. If you do though, tell me more. I'll just I'll go back to my old videos and shit talk myself all the time if you guys like it. It's not like it hurts me. But yeah. Uh, we're gonna be hopping in since the top to go to the bottom because the top has way more hot takes and bad takes than the bottom, I'd say. It's, it's evolving backwards, so yeah. So, the first video, CC to your risk 18 week 1, doesn't matter. Uh, I just use my favorite operator, so I just thought the risk 18, let's do it. So, uh, nothing much here. I'll go back to Genshin very soon. Maybe do some streams and stuff, but it gets really laggy for me. So, kind of sucks. Uh... I might have said something about your playing since April. I don't know if I really did or if, or if I don't know. Uh, but what I have actually met. Okay, so here's my play, uh, my arcade experience. I played with the game dropped. Two to three days. Not wasn't really my type of game back then. Dropped the game. That's all. Then April, Schwarz dropped. Good event. Swimsuits. Really nice stuff. Hey, let me go hop in, let me go do some summons, I don't know. Those kind of stuff. So we do that. I pull Schwarz, I get really lucky. First multi. I get out of the game, because I was still wasn't my type of game. Come back during July, end of July. Because Neon. Um, and pull for Neon. Get absolutely shafted. Uh, then I continue to play Arcanist since this day. So I've been playing since the end of July, beginning of August, whenever the Neon event was. But I have been officially back on Art Nights, playing it like daily once or two days and on logging daily. Since the oh, KO Bay right. so event. Alright, so why is it so Welcome back. So, yeah. Uh, since the KO Bay event, I've been back. That's all. Good. So that's why I don't have any M3s. And I should have M3s if I, if I wasn't so lazy to build my base. So yeah. Thorns is actually coming, are we getting a conversation? No. We did get some sort of compensation for this, even though they didn't really state it, but it doesn't matter. I just don't like that the Arknights aren't really too talkative with our community. Don't really like that, to be honest, but it's fine because we're getting thorn. We got thorns for three weeks. Just like CA got him two weeks and then one week of rerun, we're getting him straight up for three weeks. And then if we get our Nicktees for three weeks too, it's basically half a compensation, which is fine, I guess. I'll, we'll take it. Should you summon for Thorns, Adriana, and Jay? If you haven't summoned yet, then go ahead and summon if you don't want Surter. But Surter is great, so I don't know. Thorns is like one of the best units. If you didn't have anything saved, don't blame you because W was right there. But if I said something about Thorns being bad, I didn't say that. 
Uh, I thought it was a top 3 unit for me. Top 3, because I don't know where to rank him. Between Silver Ash, Thorns, or AF Yellow. That's all. Him individually, individually be about what he does. I'd say many occurrences when you're trying to run, like, uh, he would be better in Silver Ash in some cases, and Silver Ash would be better in some other cases. That's all. Talking about the event, Harvest Searching Flame, nothing really important. This is a whole meme video I liked. Fix this. Francis, I still hate it. No, I don't think I made a bad take over here. Probably the option that they should add is a filtering option, as I said. Filter to casters, get only caster friends. Filter to guards, get only guard friends. And so on. I don't want to... When I'm looking for Angelina, I don't want to be seeing seven silver ashes on my friend list, you know? So yeah. You should eat to Yarmia. Yes, you should. Uh, nothing wrong with eating units, just don't focus on her before other units are way more important. Cool video I did with W, I really liked it. Thermal EX video, me, I like that too. Zane Summons got really lucky, I like that too. Don't look at my guys, I did guys suck. Even though they worked, but uh, I'm not really good at putting up guides in time. So yeah. Next, this. Uh, which operator should you eat to first? Um, I do search out most of my stuff on Game Press because that's a really reliable source and people actually work hard to put up actual content on there. I look at articles, give my opinions and thoughts about it. That's about it. It's not like I'm saying, oh hey, I read from this article, so automatically it's my take. No, I just look at the article and say, hey, do I opinion agree with their opinion or not? Give my thoughts and opinions about it. That's all. It's literally in the title. Reviewing the E2 priority operator uh, game press. Okay, let me stop this. Basically, what this. So yeah, it's it's literally on the title. I don't see anything really wrong with it. That's all. Uh, weird video. This is my darkness and Mars like grind stream. You know, for like two hours long. It was nice. I'll probably do more streams in the future. She's done for the English Vars and Seed. Don't summon for these banners unless it's a Silver Ash and a Fiala or some other kind of broken duo. I don't know. Uh, how summoner operators work? Still, I read an article and I gave my thoughts and opinions about it. Because for all the lazy boys that are too lazy to check it out. Yeah. That's all. Release date confirmed. That's about it. Not really something too important. What banners are we getting after W? Or wait, no. After. Uh, Phantom stuff. I just put W on the thumbnail. Okay. There's this Moyer, Seven Guys, should be summoned for Phantom if you're Shamari. Well, I'd say Hunt for Shamari and. Actual. It's a good banner. Cutter, Shamari are actually amazing. But that's about it. Phantom is also really, really good. But I don't see him being good only in certain situations. When you want to bring him a certain stage and you need a specialist, Phantom is really good. But if you don't really need him on that stage, then you don't really bring him. If you get what I'm trying to say. So yeah, uh, Vent officially confirmed, a prayer tier list. Reviewing the wiki operator tier list. Just giving my thoughts and opinions, what I think about it. That's all. I love you, I Goku. Uh, Legends video I did for fun. Not all, not anything. That was a meme video. Um, nothing really with the hot takes and stuff. Okay, Miss Fungimus, I'll come back to this. I don't know how good this video was, I don't know how this did. But I just gave my thoughts and opinions over here on the tier list. So, yeah. I'll come back to it though. Uh, I'll definitely say which operators are really good, which operators are really bad for this. And just say, I just have to say that max out your three stars before this drops. Uh, three stars are gonna be incredibly useful. Yeah, they're gonna be useful for that event. So don't mess around with our three stars, you know. Uh, anniversary announce, granny event, two Genshin streams. How much I prepared? I am prepared at all. Um, Contingency contract one officially announced. Two units over here. Then my game, yeah, the new my game game is coming. No use on it, so I haven't made any videos. Strategy doesn't really matter. Dragalia, I haven't played at all, honestly. Uh, new Suzerain, the title of the, the Willowbound. 
doesn't matter, doesn't matter. Uh, Rosa and Leonhardt. I haven't seen much about Leonhardt because it wasn't that made a change, but he's decent, I'd say. He's pretty decent. Rosa is really, really good, but only on certain situations that you might bring her. Like, I used her on CC2, which was incredibly useful because of the, like, the many big guys and heavy enemies. That's about all I'd say. Then there are stages like, who else? Uh, I, I used her over at. Where is it? A Patriot stage over here. When I killed him one tile, she helped a lot for that too. So, yeah. That's about it. Next, 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 next. Um, this is a QA. Uh, that's about it. <laughs> I just look at the thumbnail. I see it's weird. Neural is better. That's all. Uh, don't suffer for the, don't suffer for these banners. I already said it. Probably my worst shafts in existence. Uh, how good is she? This is just a big review video. I really like the beak. Um, until the scene drop this CC, um, continuity con this continuity contract. I thought she was the best free to play operator. She was. She was. Yeah, she's that good. But now the scene dropped. I'll have to put them head to head to each other based on what they do. So, yeah. Because they do different stuff, obviously. Back by Blue Scott's contract, lease date, uh, how have I prepared? Not at all. Then this weird video, honestly, how does almost every stage instantly? Be me, be Technus, you, you, you lose every stage. Uh, she's 7. She, if you didn't suffer, I don't know. She's really, really good. That's all I'd say. Uh, next. What should you pick? Your choice, really. If I'm getting that again, I'm, uh, I'm getting Indra. I already got Vulcan, so yeah. We're back. Uh, this is the video I actually started Arcanine. So this is the bottom of the bottom. The worst of the worst. Not really. The worst of the worst I'm going to show you right now. Because on the video, on the video I previously recorded, because I thought the auto was good, but it wasn't. So yeah. Now we're going to go to over here to the videos can i search okay so title what was it called huge issue go 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 this let me jump into the video there we go now i'm gonna do this again just to show you guys Oh, right. So as you are more I don't agree with this video at all. Here's another special it's a bad video. Say. I know. Uh, if like you hate me for this, that's good for you. you okay. Good job. You it's actually kind of have made a good right take, which is something I want And you've actually thought incredibly well. That like holy these, shit, I shouldn't have watched this, this guy. I didn't stop it or whatever. I shouldn't watch this guy because he makes bad content. And you're absolutely right. I actually hate this video myself. I don't know what the fuck I was thinking, what the hell I was thinking when I made this video, but no idea, man. It was just really, really bad. It's one of the, my worst videos ever. That's why I privated it. I wanted to delete it, but then I was like, because I, I completely forgot about this video. I wanted to delete it, but then I thought every time that I would go back to this, uh, look at my old videos, I wanted to just, uh, Look at it and see how down bad I was. Okay, mm -hmm. so yeah, this video does supposed to be feed. Hey, uh, nice. Mhm. Mm yeah. Uh, so we don't hate me. Just want to get you know, It's a bad take. Okay, whatever. So if you hate me about that, I'm cool with it. Okay, I'm probably gonna start making better content. If you want to see me, if you have more criticism towards me. And think that our content is bad and stuff like that. It's your opinion at the end of the day. I just want to know what about me is bad. Yes, I do read stuff from the game press. Game press is cool, okay? I do check stuff on the game press. Is it wrong to check wikis? So, yeah. That's all. Uh, this video is probably my worst. That's all. Uh, thank you for watching. If you saw, if you like this kind of exposing thing, like and subscribe. I'll just do more videos like this on checking out my old videos, probably Q and A's and stuff. If you disagree with most of my videos, actually, I forgot to check this for some reason. My channel, my channel, my channel, my channel. Videos. 
Thorns is bad, as I said, top 3. J. J is my favorite 4 star in the game. That's it. I'll make a video on him. For some reason, I said over here something like J being bad, or you have to get him good to be a next to a defender. Bad take. Really bad take. He's actually one of the most capable defending specialists. He has great defense, not just as a specialist as a four star, I'd say. Unless you're mixing up with a defender. No, he's still really, really good. Offensively, he's great. His healing, his skill 2 is actually amazing. It's so close during CC2. Because if I will use a one block Vanguard, unless it was like, you know, back pipe with our skill 2, wouldn't have done much to be honest. But this guy, uh, Jay, helped a lot. So if you're having difficulties defending the top right lane with like the mages and stuff, uh, use Storms because he's really, really good. That's it. That's all. Uh, I'm gonna close off here, like, subscribe as I said at the beginning, closing off. See you guys next time. If you wanna see more videos like this, more than welcome to suggest them.